everyone, welcome back to my bedroom. You've seen me in here before to do try-ons, but you've never seen me standing up. I did get a new microphone, so I kind of want to give this a go. I will still insert my footage of me trying stuff on over here. And today's video is sponsored by Walmart, and I am really excited to have that opportunity again. So, funny thing, I just happened to place an order through the Walmart website, I'd say mid to late March, as I noticed new things coming in on their website for the warmer weather. And so I had a few things that are new to my wardrobe, and then Walmart recently reached out and asked if I'd be interested in doing this collaboration, not just highlighting some new things, which I already owned, but, highlighting that a lot of our favorites are back in stock and or not all of them but a lot of them are on sale so let's walk through the new stuff and then i want to highlight some of our old favorites obviously what i am wearing is one of the new pieces these are meant to be worn obviously as pajamas but i've been wearing it as a lounge set so a pair of sandals i'm wearing these are from last year from walmart these are great to walk around the house i'm wearing one of my favorite strappy cami sport bras from fruit of the loom i've talked about these for years tucked in the top and now it's a loungewear set i love this print it is a leopard print but if you can see it a little up close there are little pink dots in the center so a little bit of a spin this also comes in a really cute blue tie-dye that i just saw that I have to go order that one too. It's perfect for this time of year and tie-dye is making a comeback. So let's stick with the tees and the tops that I picked up first. I have the matching jogger pants that go with this and I always wanted to pick up the top. It is now on sale. If this blue camo print is not your thing, it does come in other patterns or prints. I've always loved this. If you've seen my videos from way back in 2010, I have had jewelry with this, with the evil eye or ojo. It's so lightweight, it's so drapey. I think you can tell how it moves. It would look really great with white jeans, regular jeans, shorts, very versatile. I love how drapey it is. Another great basic that I just picked up is this sleeveless tank. Two more sleeveless tops. I do prefer these to traditional tank tops. They're the straps, so to speak, are a little bit wider. These are actually marketed as two-in-one shirts, so you can see the navy one is how it obviously comes, light, very loose fitting, and it kind of flares out a little bit, but it is also marketed to be worn tied like this, and they're really easy to tie. I know that tying your shirt in a knot is a trend that's been around for a little bit, and some shirts just lend themselves better to it than others, and these are super easy to twist up and tie. You can also just tuck it in, blouse it out. Then we need to talk about these pants that I paired with those two tops. These are a linen blend and they run big. So normally I'm a size small in most things at Walmart and I did buy them in a size small and they're fine. But if I were to reorder these again, I would definitely size down to an extra small. But the details on these pants, first of all, they're super soft. Sometimes linen can get a little bit stiff. This is a linen blend, so it's really flowy and it doesn't wrinkle as easily as other linens. It has really nice deep side pockets the drawstring waist, but even little details like the strings on the drawstring are finished at the end with little metal details. These do come in other options, so if camo's not your thing, don't worry about it. I'm five foot four, I can wear these with flats, but I can also wear them with um, more of a heel or wedge and they're not gonna be like too short on me. So it's a really good length, a really good cut, really pleased with these. Let's move on to dresses. When I saw this on the website, I liked it so much, I ordered it twice. There are tons of other colors. There's a really bright fuchsia pink that is beautiful. It also comes in that same orange as the tank. I had to go with, you know, my staples gray and olive green. They are tiered, they're very flowy. I got them in a small and I think this is the perfect size for me. They would be just incredible with pockets. They don't have pockets, but you cannot have everything and for this price, I, I run them in the wash, throw them in the dryer. I don't do anything special to them. They are wash and wear and easy breezy. Then this dress makes me laugh because the first time I put it on and actually took pictures in it in my backyard, I couldn't figure out why it was so boxy and it just wasn't hanging right. It's because I had it on backwards. So this is the back and this does come in other colors. I really liked this bright green. So you can actually adjust how this hangs on you and how it drapes by pulling this drawstring and tying it tighter or looser. 
It is meant to be quite loose. I really like the bottom. The dress is pretty much a straight column until you get to the bottom and this tiered ruffle at the end is just a beautiful detail. Now, I like wearing it with these strappy camis that we've talked about before. And again, this runs pretty big. I got it in a small because generally I do wear a small at Walmart, but if I were to repurchase this or get another one, which I very may well do, I would definitely size down to an extra small. But for hanging around the house, just wearing this as a cover up to the beach or pool, it's perfect the way it is. So a lot of room, a lot of flexibility with the sizing on this one. Now let's get to revisiting some old favorites because like I mentioned, a lot of these have been restocked and or they are on sale. All the prices and stuff will be across the screen and in the description box. So let's start with the colder weather stuff because I know a lot of you are still living somewhere where it's a little bit chilly. I have three sweaters that I'm really excited about. So this exact sweater, this exact print is not available, but every year the EV1 line comes out with these great sweaters. I've always said they are really good for spring. This was actually the one I wore in my very first collaboration with Walmart and I still wear it and I still love it. And as you can see, it has held up really well. There's a 2020 version of this. Go check it out. One of the signature style markers I think of EV1 is that they have stripes on the cuffs of different colors. Love that little pop of color. So love this sweater. Another one, these are more recent. These are both from Scoop and they are both available. This also comes in navy. I believe there are more options and sizings left over in the navy version of this, but again, a really good spring summer sweater. It's just the perfect weight for layering and it has a really nice, as you can see, texture to it. And then, especially now with what we're all watching on Netflix, we all need some more animal print. This comes in two colors as well and is still available and on sale. Both of them are on sale. Now this one is a fairly recent um, acquisition. You've seen this before. I don't know what stay in the rainbow means. I don't think it means anything except it's a way to put a rainbow motif on a graphic sweatshirt or tee. And I'm here for it. I love it. It's super lightweight. It does come in other colors. And now it also comes in a t-shirt version, which is, I think, absolutely beautiful and perfect for now. So if you like this graphic, but it's already too warm where you live, there is a t-shirt option and both options are on sale. This is one of the most popular items I've ever featured on my channel. It is basically just a basic sweatshirt, but it's almost like a broken in sweatshirt. It's not too heavy and bulky. It doesn't add bulk to your frame. It's very drapey. Um, and I think it's around $10. Comes in a lot of colors. You don't have to go with this darker gray. But again, it's one of those nice things to have when the temperature drops in the evenings, you can throw this on, you can tie it around your waist. It's just one of those pieces that you're not gonna regret having it. It looks really great over leggings, which is how I've been wearing it lately. And then you've all seen these before. I, this is the one I started with. This is the Evil Eye Cardigan. It's almost like a plush um, velour type feel to the material. I loved it so much, I got it again in this sort of peachy pink shade. Um, you can see that I have issues with hanging up clothes properly. They are so drapey, so comfortable. They do come in other colors. They are still both available. So if you haven't grabbed this yet, it's a really nice layering piece for this transitional season time. And then two jackets that I want to talk about. This one is, again, one of the most popular pieces I've ever talked about. A friend of mine just texted me half an hour ago with a picture of herself wearing this. She said she's a lightweight jacket girl and this one ticked every box. She loved it so much she bought it twice. So it does come in other colors. There is a tan version and a few others as well. It's super lightweight. It doesn't really feel, it's almost like a shirt jacket. So if you are not going anywhere, it's still great to throw over a t-shirt, yoga pants, leggings, jeans, whatever you're wearing in your house. It's just, it's cozy. It's not stiff like a denim jacket. There are a few options available at Walmart, but this is the one that I love the most. It's the Time and True. It comes in this you know, traditional medium wash. There is also a white version, which I have. There is a pink version, and I think there is a light wash version. Yes, and it's again, yes, it's denim, so it's a little bit heavier than what I just showed you. That's more of a cotton twill, but it's not, it's soft, and it's, and it's lightweight, and it's not stiff, and you don't feel like you're just drowning in denim, and it does have pockets on the side, which a lot of denim jackets don't, and I, I think that should be a rule. All denim jackets should have pockets. I did want to pull this out. I think this actual print is sold out, but this wrap dress from Sofia Vergara 
does come in a bunch of other colors. It's a beautiful dress and it's on sale and it's one of my favorites. So I wanted you all to know about it and see what it looks like when it's unwrapped. So there you go. And speaking of unwrapped dresses, this one is still available. This is the utility shirt dress that I featured a month or so ago in a blog post. And I did show it in a recent try on, but I've been wearing it more as like an open trench shirt dress over a tank and jeans. It's a really nice piece. I get cold in my house because we have the air conditioning cranked up. Then I'll go outside and it's a lot warmer where I live. So it's nice to have that versatility. I just tied it in the back. It comes in quite a few colors. It's more of a modal fabric, so it's really drapey and soft, and it steams up very nicely, so it will travel well. I did want to talk about this purse. It is still available, and it's so pretty. I think it had sold out for a little while, and it's back. So if you haven't grabbed a clear bag, this is the blush version, like a nude blush, but it does come in other colorful prints, muted prints, and it does have a strap that is inside. But the one I really want to show you, this one is on super clearance. So when I bought it, it was 10 something on sale. Now it is $5. So this is a great bag to have now and to wear well into the fall, especially this deeper color. There are other color options. It does also have the strap that I've never even un done. It's just such a cool, fun bag. Look at these details. The grommets, the brass rings, there's a zipper on the inside, so everything is secure. It's, it's just so cool. So, had to mention this. And then we need to talk about shoes really, really quickly. So these were the first ones that I ordered. Let me just set one down. And these are very on trend, the big flat form kind of concept, the animal print. I love the big soles. Super easy to walk around in, very, very comfortable. I believe these come in whole sizes only. I could be wrong, but I got mine in a size seven. I can go between a six and a half and seven, and these sevens fit just fine. I'm pretty sure this comes in solids as well if you're not an animal print person, but love these for summer. Then I saw these. This is really retro. Like this is reminding me of shoes my mom wore in the 70s, but I love that molded footbed and the big buckle on the front. I love this detail. I think it's really fun. Super comfortable. These are sort of my go-to slip-ons now. When I'm running in the backyard, taking the dogs out, I just, I love these. They're perfect for this time of year. And then these are the last ones that I picked up. I'll just wear them like this for you. It's just a simple two-band slide. These are, I think, superior to other flat slides because there is the memory foam in the sole. So you're not just walking on the sole. There is a little bit of support, but if you do need a lot of support, I would skip these. The nice thing is there are about huh, five or six color combination options with these two straps. I've uh, seen one is like a black and white cheetah print with a, with a snake print. There's different kinds of leather combinations. It's, it's a very versatile little shoe here. I had to go with the metallic. I just loved it. So again, a really nice slide to have on and just slip on really quickly if you're running out the door. Probably wouldn't recommend going for long, long walks. And I feel like these do run a little bit wide. I have a wider foot and there is a lot of room. So you might want to size down in them if you are in between sizes. And I did want to end with everybody's favorite shoe, this guy. It is back. I don't know if it's every size available, but quite a few, as well as its matching friend in cream. So if you didn't grab these the first time around, they're back or they're here again. I don't know. Um, in any case, they are a great little booty and they do have the memory foam in them as well. It was really fun to show you some of the new pieces that I put into my wardrobe, as well as revisiting some of the ones that we've all loved in the recent past. And you know, some are, have been around for a little while. So let me know if you have any questions, like I said, all the sizing and the pricing and all the links in the order in which I talked about it are down in the description box. Thank you again to Walmart for sponsoring this video. And thank you to all of you for choosing to spend some time with me today to watch it. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.